piece of clay that looks like this. Okay, we're going to end up with something like this, and then we're going to cut it and attach it to a cup. The first thing you do is make the handle, let it sit, and then you're going to go and foot the cup on the whale, and then come back and attach it. I've already footed those. Okay, so you're going to pound it first so it's like a triangle, a triangular prism that's tall, a very tall triangular prism. You do a lot of the work right here in the pounding. You're going to cut it off the block of clay so it's that shape. You can't use mixer clay for this. This is one thing you really have to use um, bag clay for. Look, I'm holding it on the top. That's important. You want to hold it like it's a crane so it goes up and down. It really gives you more control. Okay. Then you want to be over some water. You can just use the bucket in the back and you start pulling down. I'm just using this knuckle against my thumb. I'm not grabbing too much. And you go from side to side. I'm, the reason I'm holding it like this is so I can rotate it and the clay is going to get longer. Okay. You might actually grab it a little bit. There are different ways to pull handles. Some people pull them attached already to the project if you have a big project, but it's basically pretty much always the same. Because this clay has come out of the bag, all the platelets are aligned and they're almost in a liquid form and they flow, okay? Sometimes you get to pinch stuff off. I didn't like that piece. You can get rid of it. A lot of clay to work with, so that's okay. At the end, you're going to use your thumb to make that dent, and you can see it's like a ribbon. It's not round. Um, because that gives it more strength. And then you're going to curl it and let it sit. Okay, let it sit like that while you go and foot your project. This way, when you come back, it's going to have a little more strength to it. It'll be set up. Okay, so I'm going to take one that's already set up. I'll take a little one and put it on the little cup. Okay, put that one aside. So you can see it's all, it's not, it's like already leather soft. It gets leather soft pretty fast. If someone took my tooth rib, I'm going to be the one. And it looks like they did. Oh, good. So you're going to take your tooth rib and you're going to cut it off. Look, it should look like this. When you cut it, you want to cut it so it still looks like a half a heart or a question mark. So it's going to look like that, okay? Because you want it to be up on the top. And you're going to adjust it so it fits on the side of your cup and make sure it looks right. Actually, that doesn't look bad. Okay. And then so I'm looking and thinking, okay, so I've got to trace it like that. Hope you guys can see. And what am I going to do where I traced it? Can you figure that out? Put the tooth rib in. Make some pretty, you know, strong marks. Put some slip on there, and then I'm going to just put the handle on. When you put the handle on, the thing most people do wrong is they, they just set it on like that. You really have to shove it and push, otherwise it will not stay on. You have to use some significant force, okay? After that, then you're going to add clay here, here, and here a little bit, and use a tool, like a rubber tip tool, to push it on and smooth it out, either smooth it out or leave marks. I like to leave the marks because that is, after all, how you made it. You can roll out a little piece of clay or just squish it. My hands are sticky. It's good to have your hands a little bit dry. And you've got to add it here, otherwise it'll break. Okay? And you've got to add some here. So when it's done then, it's smooth all the way or you've added marks and then you can let it dry. Should I just put this out on the shelf and let it dry when I'm done? Sure. No, if I do that, it'll break. So what I do is I take the bottom that I just took the handle off, and I'm going to put it in the cup, and I'm going to put that in a plastic bag, and I'm going to leave it for 24 hours. And then it should be okay. Okay, questions?